guys, today we are unboxing one of the slow cookers that came in the mail the other day for me and I am so excited. I can't wait to show you what's inside. So let's go check it out. So I'm really, really excited today because I'm finally going to get to get this slow cooker and another one I'm going to shoot here in a minute out of the box. They've been sitting over waiting for me to tape this and today I was like, I really want to be cooking in these. I've got to sit down and show them what's inside the boxes. So today's first slow cooker that I'm going to do, well actually today's slow cooker that I'm going to do, the other slow cooker I got will be in another episode and Mike's probably going to be cutting this out because this is pointless. All right. <laughs> Stop laughing at me. I'm not laughing. Yes, you are. Okay, so I recently ordered two different Black & Decker slow cookers off of Amazon. This is not a sponsored post. Um, because of how much I love the Black & Decker Wi-Fi slow cooker that I got a long time ago or several months ago, um, I just love the quality, so I thought, I haven't tried any other Black & Decker slow cookers, so I'm going to give a few a try. And this one immediately caught my eye because it is, for, for no cooking purposes whatsoever, but because it has a chalkboard on the outside of it. And I love our other chalkboard slow cooker that we have by Hamilton Beach. It's so fun to take to parties. It's fun to have on Cooking Chris's dishes where we can write the name of whatever is inside on the outside and with our chalkboard. And, all of our chalk pins and all that kind of stuff. We just love that kind of stuff. So I saw that and I'm like, well, that's that's one of the first ones I'm going to try. It also has a couple of features that um, I definitely look for whenever I'm buying a new slow cooker. And one of those is that it is programmable. Um, I love to have a programmable slow cooker because I feel like that gives me a little bit more options when I'm running errands and those kinds of things that I can set it on a, a timer. And it also helps me remember that I have something cooking because usually an alarm will go off and say when it's done. So um, the other things that it says it has is um, a rubber gasket um, to create a mess proof seal. Um, it is uh, has the um, stoneware liner that is dishwasher safe and it's a seven quart and most uh, my largest slow cooker right now that I have is a six quart so I'm excited about that and I don't have a knife to cut this open so I'll be right back all right so the other things it says it has oversized cool touch handles uh, locking wires. So we will see what that is. Oh, I think that means that it locks the handles. And then it also talks about um, having a way a, a lid hanger for like whenever you're at a party or you're ser you can serve out of the slow cooker. So we'll have to see what that is. Um, so I'm excited. So we are going to open this up, see what we've got inside. So first and foremost is the manual. We'll set it over there. Ooh, this is interesting. Um, now we have a lid that has a weird like T shape on the inside too. Um, and the warning, do not lift the slow cooker by the handle or by the lid. Um, so when you do latch it down, this is not one that you can just grab and carry around by the lid. That's not what's intended. Um, before use, oh, you're supposed to prime your chalkboard surface. So usually that means that you're supposed to like scribble the chalk all over it and then wipe it off consistently all around so that your chalkboard won't get kind of like weird stains from the first thing that you write on it. So that's good advice. You get a little box of chalk right here, which we'll play with here in a minute. And, and a nice big seven quart 
pot. That's going to come in super duper handy for when you're cooking big cuts of meat like a um, turkey breast or a large ham. Um, or even today, Mikey's um, cooking up his maple whiskey ribs and we were having a hard time fitting them in our six quart because he had so many. So this is going to come in super, super duper handy. And I'm running out of table space. I like it. Okay, more cardboard. And here's our unit. I don't think there's anything else. I'm going to get rid of the box so we can actually see what we're doing here. Okay, so this is a little different from the Hamilton Beach. Um, slow cooker that has the chalkboard sides because this is actually the unit that has the chalkboard. It is, um, it's not a panel that you take on and off. It's actually the body of the slow cooker. So that's interesting. I would dare say that that's probably going to get pretty hot to the touch too. So you're going to want to write your chalkboards, whatever you want it to be, um, most likely before or after it cools off, but not while it's cooking or immediately following cooking. So, um, like I said, this has where you can select the settings of warm, low, and high and set the timer on here. Real simple panel. I really like it. I think that's one of the things I, li I liked about my other Black & Decker was it just seemed really simple to use and it seems substantial sturdy that's what I would say okay so the way that this lid closes is the big wire clips like this which are a very interesting model um, just latch onto the lid and then you pop them down like that nice and sturdy um, I don't see there isn't a cord winder or anything like that, so there is that. But, um, so there you go. Nice, sturdy. We're going to give it um, some test runs, and we definitely will mention to you guys um, what we think about it. But um, as for that priming step that it was talking about, pretty much to prime a chalkboard, you just scribble all over it pretty evenly, pretty much with the side of it like this. You see? and then wipe it all down and you can write on it after that so that's pretty cool but yeah it's definitely got a chalkboard surface to it which is super is going to be super fun so that is our unboxing it is technically called the soon i think all it says on the side is tech technically called portable digital slow cooker um, full chalkboard wrap so I will put a link down below for any of you guys that are interested and I will definitely let you know how we like crocking with this in our kitchen well thank you guys for hanging out with me today and checking out this new slow cooker I'm sure you'll see it in a future episode of cooking Chris's dishes um, we will chat at you later bye we could call this Chris messes with lights. All I want to do is take my slow cooker out of the box. Yeah. La, 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 la. Yeah. Shh. Shh. <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness.